what do you like what, about this decision that you made? Yeah, man, I'm excited to be here. Um, just getting to know the coaching staff. Uh, I worked with Bobby for three years uh, in the Raiders, and him just knowing the type of guy he is, uh, I'm just I was really excited to get this offer and really fortunate to be here. How much did, with, uh, does your experience with him did that lead you to to being uh, you know to being here? Mm -hmm. uh, it was big time, honestly. Um, I know he helped me and. I really just want to come here and, and help as much as I can, and and Bobby's gonna be a big part of that. I don't think so. I can't stress enough how excited I am to be here. He's been an assistant um, at a few different spots, but this is his first time sort of running an offensive line room. What what do you like about him as a coach? What gives you confidence that he's uh, the right guy for that job? Yeah, you know, drawing back to being in Oakland with him, he 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 was in the run game meetings with us all the time, helping. He helped me uh, before he was O line coach. You know. Being a tight end coach, I think he'll be able to to help us see a game, see the game in a different light. And I have full confidence in Bobby. Where do you see yourself? I mean, you've got a lot of versatility. Um, mm -hmm. You play a little bit everywhere. But where do you see yourself maybe slotting in for this team right now? Um, right now, I know I'm going to compete uh, for a guard spot. Uh, and yeah, just competing. It's, that's the main word there. We, we just kept talking about just come out here and compete. Does it matter which side, left, right? No, nah, you know, I'm a, I, I can play all three interior positions um, wherever they need me, whatever, whatever I can do to help the team. You started four games. I mean, it's just the very start of free agency. There's a whole lot of players who yeah. started 16, 30, 50 games who yeah. don't have a yard waiting, you know? Uh, did you, to, to get an offer, like, right out of the box, mm -hmm. were you pleasantly surprised, or what did you think about that? Um, I wouldn't say surprised. Uh, unfortunately, or fortunately, you want to say, I, I was behind three pro bowlers at the Raiders. Uh, one of the good things of doing, being, being in that situation, I got to learn a lot from them three. Uh, especially uh, Rod, you know, Rodney Hudson helped me tremendously learning the game of football and just how to be a pro. Um, so. I'm not surprised. Like, I don't want to say I'm surprised, right, right. Uh, but you know, whenever it's nice to have a job, though. I mean, a lot of guys are, you know, waiting yeah. for the phone to ring, right? Yeah, now. yeah. Um, that's why I want to say, you know, Bobby. I would always go back to Bobby right now. Uh, just being with him for three years, uh, he kind of saw. He knew. He knew what kind of player I would be, and I think it'd be a great fit here. It seems like the response in Oakland from some of the fans and the media that covers the team is that they were rather disappointed to see you leave. Mm -hmm. uh, you, do you think that sort of speaks to the job that you did while you were there? I hope so. Uh, I just always try to go out there and give it my all. And uh, just try to go out there and maul people and and just be physical and, and just try to be the best teammate I can be. What do you think, um, if you had to you know, give us an estimation of your skill set, are you a better pass pro, run block guy? What, what would you say is your strength? Um, I like run blocking, man. I like getting after people. Uh, not the same, I, you know, mind a pass play every now and then, but you know, just being able to run my feet and drive a guy, drive a guy down to the ground is kind of my thing. So, um, Bill's Mafia or the Black Hole? I mean, you're, you kind of seen the. You're, <laughs> yeah. You're gonna see. What yeah, the, yeah. But, but, I mean, um, give us an impression. I was fortunate to, when I was at Miami. You know, we had crazy fans in Miami. Then going to Raider Nation, uh, appreciate them. You know. Uh, but now, Bill's Mafia, that's like the next step. That's like the highest of high you can get. That's take, taking steps. Or stuff. the lowest of lows. <laughs> <laughs> what do you remember about the game here a couple of years ago? Yeah. So. Um, <laughs> yeah I have some nightmares of that game. We, uh, I was mainly on kickoff return that game, and they were squibbing the ball all over the, uh, all over the field. And I remember trying to block uh, Taiwan, and and Lorenzo, and that was just not a fun day for me. <laughs> what do you remember about the atmosphere in the stadium? It was great. They were loud and yelling. Uh, it might have been rain that day, but, you know, Bill's Mafia, they're crazy. You, you, you mentioned... Going uh, from playing behind three pro bowlers, mm -hmm. now this opportunity, I mean, mm -hmm. how much are you, like, ready to put a helmet on tomorrow and get going? Yeah. Now you can finally show what yeah. you can do. Definitely. Um, I kept telling the coaches how grateful I am, you know, just to be able to 
have a chance to start, you know, to be able to compete. Uh, and honestly, that's the only thing you can ask for. Is that how you kind of view this as, a, as an open competition and the job is there for you to take it if you show you're the right guy? Yeah, um, I think we're all going to come in here and compete, uh, learn, and, and just try to be together as an offensive line. Thanks, Thank John. You.